it strange for you being the oldest guy in the room now? Uh, no, I just always felt like I had like a little old soul. And um, I just think like the age really didn't matter to me. I was kind of already an old, you know, rookie coming into the league. So people always call me old even before I even, you know, took a snap. So um, it's definitely different. I wouldn't say it's weird, but, you know, I mean, it's a role that, you know, I've been preparing for for a while. And, you know, I'm just really excited to get after it and, you know, lead a lot of these guys and, you know, help the team out. Like you and Derek, I know I work together today. I know caught that pass down the scene there. Mm -hmm. on seven, on seven. Just what's it been like kind of getting on the same page with him? Yeah, it's been good. Uh, obviously, you know, everybody's excited to see what, you know, Derek can do. And, you know, us having a lot of weapons around him is, is going to make it a lot easier for him knowing that a lot of guys are here. And so I'm um, just really excited to, you know, make the plays when I can. And obviously it's OTA, so it's very early. But, you know, it's just things to build chemistry and build trust. And this is the time to do it. You feel different, or how, how would you describe how different you feel right this minute than you did at this time last year? I mean, it's, yeah. it's got to be a huge difference, right? <clears throat> yeah. Um, you can just feel a different energy, especially in the locker room. There's a lot of new faces here, so guys are still trying to, you know, feel each other out. You know, obviously, you have a new quarterback in the, in the, in the flow of things. We've got a new tight end in the flow of things, different receivers. So, it's, a, it's, a, it's obviously, there's a lot of um, different moving parts. But I think the biggest thing is that we all want one common goal, and that's just to keep winning games. And, you know, we're having a lot of fun doing it. This is probably the most fun I've had in OTA so far, <laughs> knowing that it's only been the first one. But, um, you know, really excited to see what we have because there's a lot of new guys, and, you know, I think DA is uh, putting all his chips forward so we can make this thing happen. So I'm um, really looking forward to what the season has. I hate to say it, I actually meant you personally. How do you feel different from a oh. year ago? <laughs> oh, me. Um, I feel really good, you know, honestly. Um, I've been, I feel like I've been working really hard on, you know, the things I need to work uh, work on. And so uh, compared to last year to this year, you know, my body feels a lot better knowing that it's not the end of the year. But um, honestly, just physically, um, mentally, just a whole lot better. And you know, ready to really get after it. What are some of the things that you want to work on? Uh, the things that I want to continue working on is obviously the pass blocking thing and, and the run blocking thing. Blocking was kind of the biggest thing. And, you know, also just, you know, catching them, just, just everything really, but more, more so the run game and the pass game because you know, that's something that, you know, we're going to need, you know, in the coming weeks. And, you know, there's really no true, you know, why. There's no real true tight end. You know, we're all in the same position. We can move and be uh, interchangeable. So that's kind of the biggest emphasis that Clancy had. And, you know, I'm really excited to, you know, see what he has for us. Jordan, I was sure? asking Derek um, <clears throat> if he's done some scouting on, you know, some of the guys like watch tape clips. Yeah. And he said, yeah, for guys like you. And then yeah. like, send some highlights and say, do this on this route. I yeah. like what you did on this route. Yeah. I mean, has there been that kind of yeah. early communication? Yeah. Um, I've already asked um, some of our, you know, guys that, you know, put in some uh, Edelman film. And so I've been watching a lot of Edelman this past, you know, week or two just because I know the type of role that I'll be doing. And, you know, he loves those routes that Edelman's running. So he's probably one of the best at those, you know, choice routes, you know, short game routes. And so, you know, uh, we've talked a bit about it. And, you know, we have something cooking coming up. So I'm really excited. Why, why did you choose him? Uh, Edelman is, is – probably one of the best, you know, short game receivers that the game has ever had. So, you know, learning from a guy like Edelman and watching his film and seeing what he does, you know, that's, I, I could only look at his film. Does your skill set and Foster's skill set sort of complement each other in a nice way, would you definitely. say Definitely. I would say our personalities kind of match too. But uh, I definitely think, um, you know, our, our skill sets definitely match. You know, he's a guy who has been in the league for quite a while now. He's already been with Darren Waller. He's been with, you know, D.C. And so, you know, knowing that he's already been in a system like that, um, he feels good. I mean, he can, he can run well, he runs great routes, he can catch, he can block, he can do all the things that a tight end, you know, is needed for a tight end. So I'm really excited to see um, what he has, you know, in the upcoming weeks, you know, trying to get it come to a new offense. Same quarterback, just new offense, New Jersey number. So um, just really excited for him.